Father Altman, you said this recently in a homily, quote, liberal Catholics practicing infidelity after infidelity. Liberalism all boils down to reason over the exclusion of faith. Science, so-called science, not God. The independence of the mind and the will from God, and that is eternally dangerous ground. So there are many in leadership positions where we can see this embodied, and certainly, as you mentioned earlier in the show, that's really a reflection of the, the many within the general population that are thinking this way. It goes hand in hand. So this is is this is rampant, a rampant error of our day. Anything else to which you can share share with us to help us to look out for this, to avoid it ourselves, help others to get off of this, this dangerous uh, path to hell. Right. You, know, you know what I appreciate is that you actually say it that way because that's exactly what it is, a path to hell. The road is narrow that leads to eternal life. Um, here's the thing. So this is just taken from a, a current example of what liberalism does. You got those German bishops and cardinals over there. You got Austrians in there, too. And now you even have rumors that it's coming out of the Vatican, too. They're a little dismayed about the recent statement that you can't bless sin. Now, if you have any faith at all in any, I don't care whether it's Christianity or Catholicism, whether it's Islam, whether it's Judaism, if you have any faith at all, then you certainly know that, uh, that there is a transcendent truth uh, from the Creator and that we uh, must follow that truth and so when when that truth has been present for 4,000 years who in the heck thinks that they somehow in the year 2021 can change the truth like I, when I teach the kids I teach them that 2 plus 2 is 4 today it was 2 plus 2 2000 equals 4 2,000 years ago with Jesus. And, and if we live another 2,000 years, you know what? Two plus two is still gonna equal four. Truth is truth, it's unchanged, unchangeable. So that now you have the, the, the Germans and those Austrians and even some people in the Vatican who are in open revolt against the truth that you cannot bless sin. And that is the, the epitome of liberalism. And you get to decide for yourself, listen, you've heard it, it's so, it's so stupid. People are just, these people who say this are just so stupid. They don't have a brain there. God gave them a brain, they're not using it. When you hear them say, um, well, that might be true for you, but it's not true for me. Uh, no, no, truth is truth, period. And, and who is truth? If you're Catholic or if you're Christian, what did Jesus say? I am the truth and I am the way and I am the life. So you follow my way to eternal life, that is the truth, or or you can be one of the many choosing, because it's a choice, the broad road to destruction. 